welcome back to Azure Terraformer. Today we're going to be ask, answering the question, what is the difference between Azure OpenAI and ChatGPT? I'd like to first start by just asking ChatGPT what, this very same question. What is the difference between Azure OpenAI and ChatGPT? I couldn't have said it better myself. Azure OpenAI and ChatGPT are related but distinct concepts. Azure OpenAI is a suite of artificial intelligence, AI, and machine learning tools and services provided by Microsoft Azure, a cloud computing platform. It includes tools for building, training, and deploying machine learning tools, as well as pre-built models for tasks such, such as natural language processing and computer vision. ChatGPT, on the other hand, is a specific instance of a language model based on the ChatGPT 3.5 architecture is developed by OpenAI, an independent research organization and designed to generate human-like text in response to a given prompt. ChatGPT is one of the many possible applications of AI and ML and can be used with Azure OpenAI or on any platform that supports language models. Let me clarify a little bit because I'm, I'm not super satisfied with this answer. Um, and of course, it's a, fa it's a fantastic answer as generated by uh, ChatGPT itself. Um, but for somebody that's new to ChatGPT or new to OpenAI, um, there's a couple of things going on, right? One, there's what all the, how do I put this? There, there's what all the normies are using, which is the chat interface. And by normie, I mean people that are non-technical, right? Like you go on YouTube and there's just rando, you know, people talking, you know, talking to ChatGPT and like having fun with it, which is by all means, go do that. Like I, I do that myself. It's pretty fun. Um, but the, there's a chat GPT interface that people use and, and just ask questions and it's damn useful. Like you can ask it to do coding stuff for you. Um, you can ask it, you know, medical questions and it'll always be like, I'm not a doctor, but you know, here's the answer. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's a great tool. Um, but, and you can pay $20 a month to upgrade that to get, I think chat GPT four, uh, which I also am a subscriber of. Um, but there's also an open AI offering um, for developers. And that open AI offering is an actual API. Now to use that API, I've reviewed the pricing differences between Azure open AI and open AI's API. Uh, the pricing is identical, right? Um, so the developer version of open AI is basically the same thing as Azure OpenAI. It's, it's an API. You, it's designed to be used by software that communicates directly with the OpenAI language models and other, and other learning models, which is very different and distinct from the chat interface that normies use, normies like myself, uh, to find out what the best flavor of Popsicle is, you know? So Azure OpenAI does not have a chat interface that's open to the public. Um, it does have a chat interface that I've demoed on this channel that, that even has features that don't exist in the chat GPT world, right? Um, in my first video about OpenAI, about Azure OpenAI, um, you saw me actually give the, the AI a prompt to tell it who it was, right? So basically it's like, hey, this is your role, this is your responsibility, go do this, right? Um, and that's a pretty powerful uh, feature, which is unavailable, as far as, far as I know, to the regular chat-based interface uh, when somebody logs into chat.openai.com. You are talking to a generic instance of ChatGPT that is designed to help you answer questions. And so really, there's no guardrails uh, there's no way to control the guardrails for that for that chat interface, whereas with Azure OpenAI and I would I would imagine the OpenAI API itself, those guardrails exist and you can kind of configure them and you know train it uh, train the AI more to fit your particular business purpose. So those are those are some of the different. That's the big difference between ChatGPT and Azure OpenAI and the OpenAI API itself. I hope that clears things up. Um, look for more content on Azure OpenAI, um, how to automate it, how to develop with it on this uh, channel. Uh, looking forward to delve further. 
Um, if you like this video, please smash like. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And uh, make, make sure to ring that bell when you do uh, so you know when my next video drops. Anyways, this is the Azure Terraformer signing off. Thank you.